An example of how enzymes function in the body is from the enzyme sucrase. Sucrase resides on the surface of the microvilli on the intestinal epithelial mucosal cell surfaces. This animation presents a graphical representation of the way that sucrase catalyzes the hydrolysis of the common disaccharide sucrose, which we know as table sugar, into its component monosaccharides, glucose or blood sugar, and fructose or fruit sugar. Hydrolysis is accomplished because when the sucrose molecule binds to the active site of the enzyme, the enzyme's configuration is changed so that the oxygen bridge between the two monosaccharides is exposed to water molecules in the solvent. This exposure permits a water molecule to actually break the bond, the oxygen bridge, and attach the components of water, an OH to one of the monosaccharides and an H to the oxygen which is still attached to the second monosaccharide. This effectively cleaves the bond between the two monosaccharides and converts the disaccharide into two separate sugars. Once this is accomplished, the enzyme's configuration is changed back to the original shape. The two monosaccharides float away and the site becomes available for another sucrose molecule to bind, change the enzyme's configuration, and be hydrolyzed. This action can be repeated many times until the enzyme becomes denatured, is inhibited, or just wears out.